What's going on everybody? Aubrey69 here and I got another video here for you. Some Modern Warfare 3 and this time around I'm doing another gameplay on Kill Confirmed Hard Hat. This is a bomb match. I end up going uh, 46 or not 46 uh, 64 and 14. 64 and 14 on Kill Confirmed. Um, I am running assault package. I got predator missile, attack helicopter, and a pave row. As you can see, I'm running MP7. I got range and silencer on it. Um, rocking the Semtex and flashbang. I uh, don't do much camping. I like to run a gun. Uh, when I started out Call of Duty, I started out back on uh, Call of Duty 4, the first Call of Duty that I played. I've played them all now, but uh, Call of Duty 4 is the one that got me into the series. Um, when Modern Warfare 2 came out, that's all I did. I would camp. You know, they had the Scavenger Pro. You could re scav your uh, freaking Claymores, and, you know, I just camp. I was bitch back then but you know what I try and camp now I can't I just I have to run and gun even my teammates like oh stay in this area help me out blah blah like, can't do that crap I have to be running you know I, I'll try you know maybe once in a while in one of my videos you may see me you know camp around I camp here for a sec because I know they're there but as soon as I kill them I'm running I'm gone I don't like to hang out in one spot for too long you know, usually I run my scavenger pack, but I decided to salt this time, so I'm going to slay the hand. So I've had to pick up other people's weapons. I love killing somebody with their own weapon. But, you well, know, um, let's talk a little bit about Black Ops 2. You know, what, how do you guys feel about Black Ops 2 from the previews in, you know, at, uh, when they came out with all the multiplayers on uh, Domination and the Hardpoint game mode, you know, some of the new game modes they got coming out, the way that they do intermission on Domination, I really, really like how they did that. Uh, the Hardpoint, it looks sick. Um, I, it's not, I haven't heard anything confirmed yet, but I really hope that they bring back Kill Confirmed because, well, obviously it's my favorite. I'm ranked like one. 50th in the entire world, which is pretty freaking sweet. But, you know, gosh, I apologize. You know, it's late right now. Had a few drinks, and this is a nine minute video. I don't know much what to talk about for nine minutes in a single video, but I'm just gonna wing it here. Bear with me, and we will get through this. Um, Let's talk about other games coming out you know, this year. We got Borderlands 2 coming out later this month. That's another one that I'm really excited for. I don't know if anybody has played Borderlands 1, but it is a boss game. You know, it's one of the replay values high. You know, first person shooter, and it's like an RPG. You level your guys up, and it's awesome. I'm excited. I'll probably be doing some gameplays on that. Uh, a lot of the games coming out, I'll be doing commentaries for, or gameplays, you know, just plays, whatever. Because I love doing it. I like making videos, and hopefully you guys might like watching them just as much as I enjoy making them. But, anyway, on to... I was, that, that's really the only game I'm excited for coming up this month, is Borderlands 2. And then the next month, we got... Resident Evil 5, 6, Resident Evil 6, there we go, and that one looks sweet, I'm not too sure if I'm going to get that one right away, I know it's one I'm definitely going to play, I don't know if I'm going to get it right away, if you guys want to see, you know, some Resident Evil 6 gameplays, just leave a comment, let me know, and hey, maybe I'll fork out the money right away and buy it, but as for right now, I'm probably not going to get it right away, uh, 
Let's see, another game it's coming about out about the same time as Black Ops 2, and that is Assassin's Creed 3. Which, if you have not seen the previews for this game, it looks amazing. Now, there's Assassin's Creed, Assassin's Creed 2, Brotherhood, and Revelations. And Brotherhood and Revelations are all off of Assassin's Creed 2. There are continued stories from Assassin's Creed 2. And Assassin's Creed 3 is in a totally different era, totally different direction with the game, and it just looks amazing. Again, another game I don't think I will get right when it comes out because I still haven't beaten Revelations. I mean, I love Assassin's Creed. I've played them all. I got my platinum trophy on Assassin's Creed 2, but I've never played those games directly when they come out. I always have waited at least a couple months but I will play that one if you guys want to see some stuff let me know uh, but Black Ops 2 is the one I am excited for I will be doing gameplay videos on campaign you know try to do walkthrough because I'm gonna get a platinum trophy on that game and I would like other people to get a platinum trophy and so I hope you guys get one I'll be doing zombies plays man I am excited for zombies, I can't tell you. I got the Black Ops 2 poster that you get when you pre-order it. Man, that sits next to my TV when I video game and see it all the time. Man, I, I can't wait. That is just the game. I I love MW3, but like with every Call of Duty game, I love it until it gets to the end and I just get burned out on it, you know? And especially this one, I've just played it too damn much, and there's so much stuff that they could improve on, and stuff that they try to improve on, other stuff lacks, and it just, it's a big mess that they should just leave alone, and leave it as it is. But, you know, there's always going to be people complaining, so, no. People are always trying to change it, like, the nerfing guns, I hope that they just get it right, and what they pick at the beginning of Black Ops 2, I just hope that they don't change anything. You know, except for like glitches and stuff like that. But as far as weapons, man, they just need to keep them how they are. People need to not complain. You know, people are complaining, oh, he uses a silencer, blah, blah, blah. Like, they wouldn't put these things in the game if they weren't supposed to be used. Uh, you know, I like those people. You know, hey, why don't you tell me what you want me to use, and I'll kick your ass either way. And I do. It doesn't matter. I'll use any gun and whoop ass. I may not have a high KD, but I'm going to whoop your ass, you know. Plain simple. My clan, we throw down. As you can see in this video, I love games like this, where you got such a good clan. And my clan, now I got some tough guys in it, even if... Like I said, they don't have a strong KD, man. They're just strong players, and that's all you need. Good teamwork, and we prevail, you know. But anyway, here's coming up at the end of the video. I'm about to get the game-winning kill. 64-14. It's amazing gameplay. You know, holding out on tags for as long as we can, just getting the kills, making it look like close game, but it really wasn't that close. But... Now, you're going to check out the score, and you're going to just see my clan dominated. And we were short of one from full clan. But anyway, I'm Obdur69. Check out the rest of my channel. Give me some likes, some comments. Subscribe if you like what you see. Also, follow me on Twitter. Thanks for the support, and you all have a good day.